So hello guys, welcome back. This is Viran Kumar. So in this video session, I am going to uh, discuss about the Azure DevOps. So uh, the Azure is providing the lots of services, and the Azure DevOps is one of them. Okay. So if you are from the automation backgrounds, you are from the testing backgrounds, and you want to switch on the Azure a uh, DevOps role. Okay. So for that, what you have to do, I am going to discuss. About in this uh, video, this is basically for the Azure DevOps engineer role. So first, uh, we will access the Azure DevOps Services portal. Okay, uh, earlier video I was shown that the how we can access the Azure portal, and in this video I am going to show the Azure DevOps Service portal. So both are the different uh, portals. Okay, then uh, we will discuss all the plans for the Azure DevOps Services. There are some free plans. and basic plans and which we can use for the practice so <clears throat> if you are preparing for the azure devops engineer certification then you need to do some practice on your local systems so for that uh, we can take one of them plan from the azure devops services and then we can start doing the practice for that okay so to access the azure devops service portals i'll go into the <clears throat> google and there i will type the Azure DevOps, okay, and there you will get the uh, Microsoft Officer site. So uh, this is Azure dot Microsoft dot com. This is Azure DevOps services. I'll just click on this link. Now you can see this is the Azure DevOps site. So, okay, so there are two options: start free and the start with the GitHub. Yeah. Now if you scroll down, then what it will provide? It will provide the Azure boards, Azure pipelines, Azure repos, Azure test plans. Azure Artifact and extensions markets. Uh, these are the Azure DevOps services. Okay, the five services we will use when we are going to log in the Azure DevOps services portal. Okay, so I am going to start with the uh, free version of the Azure DevOps for for my practice. So I'll just uh, click on it, start free, and then uh, it will ask me to the login. Okay, so in earlier video I have. already explain that how we can uh, log in to the azure portal okay i just registered with the microsoft account and i am going to log in with azure devops so azure devops you can log in with the microsoft account so you know how to create it you just watch my first video of this series now i'll say the country so i'm going to select the country Okay, so this is a country name. I just selected and say continue. Okay, and then uh, I'm just almost done. So name Azure DevOps organization. So this is the Azure DevOps organization name. Okay, you can give any uh, the Azure DevOps organization. So from where you can access uh, the portal. Okay. Okay, I'm just giving this name and uh, we will host your project in. Okay, and then I'm going to enter the this captcha value. Then just say continue. Okay. The Azure DevOps portal, and here you can see the organization name. So on the left side, you have the organization name, and um, this is a search. From there, you can search the other things. Over there in the under the Azure DevOps and work items pull request request from there you can browse the marketplace and the manage extensions we will talk later about this one and this is the like how uh, the account manager and this is you can see uh, the name is the account manager from which account we have logged into this account now I'm going to create a project. Name is just Azure project, and now the visibility. We if we want to make it public or the private. So as of now, I am going to make it private. So only the people you give access will be able to view this project. So I want to, you know, limit by the permissions. So I am just going to select the private, and then I'll say the kit project. Now I have this 
test azure project so now the project is in my hand uh, this you can say test azure project okay and uh, this is the dashboard uh, we can uh, go to the dashboard and these are the boards okay and the repos and the pipelines and the test plans artifacts so these are the five things is very important for the azure devops engineer okay and we will discuss one by one in the next video so this is how we can uh, create the project and uh,